I'm impressed. The new hospital is very well equipped. I'm happy you're pleased, Mr. Tracker. It never could have been built if it weren't for your generous contributions. Friendly chap, wouldn't you say? You two seem to be getting along quite well. I should hope so. Back in the States, I own an exotic pet store. Hey, stop that. My head is not a trash can. <laughs> <laughs> Great danger! Great danger! Great danger! Hello, what is it? We, we sail down river. We see them. They attack. Chase us. Destroy boat. Who attacked you? I would not believe if my eyes did not see. Giant caterpillars! Giant caterpillars? This I'd like to see. Me too. No, Scott. You stay here with T-Bob. Let's go, Alex. I don't see anything wrong. Maybe Kala and his men were exaggerating. If these little blighters really exist, I'd like to take one back with me. What in the world? There's not a scrap of vegetation left. Look over there. Are they what I think they are? By Joe, those are the biggest eggs I've ever seen. But how did they get so big? A computer analysis of some of that caterpillar eggshell should give us an answer. Scan indicates member of Lepidoptera insect family in larval stage. Examination reveals eggs have been genetically altered. Genetically altered caterpillar eggs? That doesn't make sense. <laughs> Great Scott! Looks like you need a bigger cage. Look at them eat. At the rate they're going, the jungle will be stripped bare in a matter of days. Of course, those bounders are vegetarians. The caterpillars that attacked the villagers' boat weren't after them. They were after the food they were carrying. Very interesting. Anything wrong, Alex? Well, not exactly wrong, but extremely curious. Look over there. It looks like some kind of war. It goes all over the place. Come on, let's check it out.
I'd like to know who's firing at us. Rats. I don't know who you are, but don't come back. I think they'll poke their noses around here for a long while. Well, one thing's settled. Venom's involved. And that means it's time to call in mask. Priority one emergency. Select the best mask agents for this mission. Selection complete. Recommended personnel, Otto McLean, weapons specialist and field strategist. Vehicle code name, Firecracker. Brad Turner, expert motorcycle and helicopter pilot. Vehicle code name, Condor. Personnel approved. Assemble Mobile Armored Strike Command. Just this morning, this part of the jungle was impenetrable. What do you make of this wall, Honda? I'm not sure, but from the condition of it, it has to be thousands of years old. But what could Venom have to do with this? Dude, do we need all these coconuts? We might get hungry, T-Bob. We? All I need is an oil change. We've got to get them away from there before they discover the map. It's Venom, quick! To your vehicle! It's gone. Interesting. of my hypno headlight. Vanessa's up there and not down here. Better check it out. Vanessa, you've got company. Just one more shot. Cover me. Finish it up. I'll handle him. Mayhem sure doesn't want me to get near her. What are they up to? I got everything we need. Eight by ten and wallet size. Venom, mission accomplished. Then let's get out of here.
It looks like there's no need to hurry. <laughs> With trap. We can't hold on much longer. I'm going to see if I can find out what Vanessa was doing up there. So that was it. Now I see what Mayhem was after. Somehow he knew about this and was using the caterpillars to clear away the jungle. It all makes sense now. Computer, decipher and analyze map, please. Pictograph map was constructed by the ancient Malacca civilization several thousand years ago. Wow! We're standing on a giant map! In some ways, the Malaccas were further advanced scientifically than we are. Pictograph apparently points the direction to the location of an undetermined source of great power. That's what Venom wanted. Computer, interface object of map. Give us coordinates of the location of this power source. I don't know what kind of power it has, but we'd better get there before Venom. According to the map, this is the waterfall we've been looking for. The hidden valley is behind it. Dagger, drive through, check it out. It's all clear. There's plenty of room to fly through. Let's go. This is it! The Hidden Valley! What we want is in that cave. What's that? I stole this from an antique dealer in the Orient who didn't know what it was. What's written on it? Its inscription told me the map was carved on the jungle floor. Once that ancient power source is in our hands, nothing can stop us. It's that room. The power source is in there. Crystal. Ooh, sure beats the rings I've seen. According to the inscription, once I insert this into the crystal, it should activate the power source.
According to the computer, our destination is behind the waterfall. Let's go. Mm, I don't think I like this. Yeah, me neither. Sounds to me like we just armed a bomb. I'll fix that. Ah! It's jammed, and it's extremely hot. I'm getting out of here. All right, let's go and check things out. Alex, that high pitch sound. Scan the area. Something's wrong. Liam, here comes Beth. This may work out better than I thought. Scanner indicates a powerful mass is overloading. Matt, according to the computer, there is a mass with an overload of power in this cave. There is a chance of an explosion, and we don't have much time. Quick, to the cave. Destroy that crystal. Spectrum, on. It's no use. It's just using up my energy. What's going on? It's Venom's doing. We're trapped! <laughs> That's the end of them. Let's go! gonna blow up what are you gonna do dad matt i'll use my blaster blaster on hondo it's no use if spectrum doesn't work that means all of the other weapons are useless there's still hocus pocus hocus pocus on oh. They're going into the cocoon state. Now they'll change into butterflies? Not exactly, Brad. You see, because of their size, their metabolism is different. They'll probably sleep for centuries. Yeah! And after all this, so could I. <laughs> <laughs> You sure this is safe? Yeah, I've done it lots of times. Whee! Uh, this is fun. T-Bob, you get off of. I can't see where I'm. Don't you two ever do that again. A bike is made for one passenger only. You could have gotten hurt. 
I sure feel like a blooming idiot. <laughs> Fox Kids, Fox Kids, Fox Kids, Fox Kids.